Have you noticed the red CUSIP numbers on the bottom? CUSIP is the acronym for Committee on Uniform Security Identification Procedures, a committee of the American Bankers Association. A CUSIP number is used to identify a financial asset or bond. This bond is a security note on the New York Stock Exchange. Why? Because you are worth money to the international bank that bought your identity during the bankruptcy of America in 1933. The birth certificate became the identification of the monetization of the spirit and body of a living human being. With the existence of the birth certificate, your straw man was born, the artificial, legal, on paper, you. And this artificial you represents the debt America will never be able to pay off. In 1913, the Federal Reserve Act was signed into law by Woodrow Wilson. And prior to that, Americans owned property free and clear of mortgages or taxes. The Federal Reserve is a maritime lender operating on interest and taxes. When the United States went bankrupt in 1933, the international bankers swooped in and the United States government pledged to sell everyone out by leveraging our future earnings, labor and assets as collateral to back all of the money the government borrowed. As an added bonus, our government also pledged our federal territories, national parks and nonprofit organizations. And because of this power play by the international bankers in 1933, London still runs and owns the United States. Until the Federal Reserve is completely abolished and we return to the gold standard, the United States is 100% controlled. Do not fool yourself to think otherwise. So back to the straw man. The straw man is your legal persona. It is the name on your birth certificate displayed in all capital letters. Capital equals money. Your marriage license, your car title, your health insurance, the list goes on. Your straw man exists to confuse you into thinking that you actually own everything you buy. The straw man is the artificial you. And if the artificial you fails to make a payment, the powers that be can take your car, shut off your energy, your cable, turn off your water, and even take your child away. When your child is born, the minute you sign their birth certificate, they become a ward of the state. And if you don't follow their rules, the state can come and take your child.